This is Leo's Animal Planet. Today we're looking at one of the most amazing migration of all time. We're looking at the Donald Mexos, Mexos, also known as monarch butterflies. <laughs> The swarms of the monarch butterflies are incredible. The display of the collective intelligence and survival. This tiny little creature makes a 3,000 mile journey each year from Canada to the United States to Mexico. If the wind is strong, they can fly all the way to Great Britain. How come to Great Britain? They start from an egg, they become a caterpillar, <gasps> they eat, munch their favourite leaves, and then they turn into a chrysalis and then they turn into a butterfly and they do their favourite thing, pollinating plants. The monarch butterfly caterpillars drink milkweed and did you know that milkweed is poisonous? They suck all the poison from the milkweed to deter predators from eating them. Well, that then, the human race, um, all of the ecosystem would not survive. One out of three of our food is made by pollinators, bees and butterflies. The pollinators support our food, um, clean the air and support other pollinators and animals. I know you're not going to be talking, asking about money, but let's talk about money. Pollinators and butterflies and other animals that pollinate um, from 200 billion pounds or maybe euros to the economy. This amazing monarch butterfly does a 3,000 mile journey to United States, America, and then to Mexico, and they fly together to migrate each year. These bonnet butterflies show that everything is connected and the world has no borders. In order to start their long journey, they have to use your, their superpower, one of the most accurate clock found in nature. They use what's called a time competed sun compass. As the day passes, there and the sun moves across the sky, they know where to go. And it's like some sort of GPS in their brain. It's also for they use magnetism, which is pretty weird. It's like a marathon and it, then it becomes an enormous multi-generational relay race where children finish the long journey their parents and grandparents started. The monarch butterfly was a sacred symbol for the Mayas and Aztecs. You can find many butterflies on very old temples and old artifacts. The Mayan Aztecs thought that the monarch butterflies were the spirits of fallen warriors or loved ones when they celebrated it on the Day of the Dead. Dias de los Muertos. 
Las mariposas significan que, que son las ánimas. ¿Cómo las mariposas? Cuando veo una mariposa, pienso que es uno de mis abuelitos, o de mis tíos, o de los angelitos. Sadly, the beautiful monarch butterfly is on great threat. Suffering from climate change and the use of pesticides. The sacred forests in Mexico are being logged illegally and replaced by avocado farming. The fight that 90% of the monarch butterflies have died. The monarch butterflies still haven't been added to the endangered species list. I would like to dedicate this video to two full memories. Romero Gomez and Raul Aranes, who dedicated their lives to save the monarch butterflies and fought against the illegal logging and deforestation. They were both killed last year. Ven a conocer esta maravilla de la naturaleza, son las novias del sol, el alma de los muertos, simplemente patrimonio de la humanidad, esperamos.